Hello, sometimes our users ask how to merge two or more LUTs into one LUT in 3D LUT Creator. In this video, I will show you how to do it. In which cases may it be necessary to merge several LUTs into one? For example, I'm working with a log video. Suppose I have two LUTs. The first LUT works with the log material and converts it to Ret 709. Let's call it converting LUT. The second LUT grades video in Rect 709. Let's call it grading LUT. In order to not apply two LUTs sequentially, you can build one LUT which will do both converting and grading. Firstly, it will save my time. Secondly, it will save computing resources when rendering. Thirdly, I can make pre-LUT for raw material and load it from my camera for quick material review and so on. So let's see how I can merge two or more LUTs into one in 3D LUT Creator. First, I will need a HALD file. Hald is a LUT in graphical form. It contains pixels of different colors. You can download it for free on the Files and LUTs page from 3dlutcreator.com. I run 3D LUT Creator and load the Hald file. I go to External LUT section on the Mask tab. I press Load External LUT button. LUTs that I apply to my footage are located in DaVinci LUT folder. If you do not know where it is on your computer, you can open the project settings, then go to Lookup Tables tab and click on Open LUT Folder button. Here is the path to your folder. For quick access to this folder, you can add it to your favorite bookmarks as I did. So I load the converting LUT. Note that it is important to follow the order of LUT's application, first converting, then grading. Now I open the image menu and choose Process Image with Current LUT and Reset Settings. Done. Now I apply the grading LUT. The resulting hauled must be saved in the native format, in this case PNG. Any formats that use compression, such as JPEG, will destroy your color correction. Now I can reset the settings and load the edited hauled as an external LUT. 3D LUT Creator allows you to create LUTs based on hauled files. All I need to do is to save my final LUT in the .cube format right away in DaVinci LUT folder. I go to DaVinci and press Update Lists. This is how the video looks when I apply both LUTs. Now I delete the second node and I load my new LUT that simultaneously converts and grades the video. As you can see, there is no difference. Let's consider the case when the grading LUT doesn't fit your video well. In the first node, I load the converting LUT again. In the second node, I load another grading LUT. Most likely this LUT is designed for another material, and the final result doesn't suit me. So before merging LUTs, I would like to change my grading LUT. What do I do in this case? In order to see how to change the second LUT, I need a video frame, to which the converting LUT has already been applied. So I need to export it from DaVinci. I disable the second node. Then right mouse click, choose Grab Still. I export the frame in TIFF format. I load it into 3D LUT Creator. I load grading LUT in the external LUT section. In 3D LUT Creator, there is a master section where you can adjust the blending of the LUT effect as well as adjust various parameters. I will slightly reduce the effect of the LUT. I don't like that this LUT changes the black point, so I exclude the LUT's influence on the shadows using Lightness Mask. This is before, that is after. Now I save this LUT. I reset all settings and repeat the procedure that I did before. I load the hauled, then process it with converting LUT. Then I apply the corrected gradient LUT. I save the hauled. Reset the settings. Then I load the hauled into the external LUT section and create cube LUT on its basis. I save it to the DaVinci LUT folder. I open DaVinci and press Update the lists. 
Now I load a new combined line. Done. That's all. I hope this lesson was useful, especially for those of you who work with videos. See you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.